In today's video, we'll be showing you how to put on the Cartier Love Bracelet in the ESM version. This particular piece is the full pave rose gold size 19. Absolutely stunning piece with the full round brilliant cut diamonds, fully pave set, but still showing the iconic screws. This piece is very similar in its closure settings, but still differs uh, from the normal love bracelet setting, uh, the closure settings. Uh, I'll go into more detail just to show you in a second on how to open it and close it uh, safely and securely. But this has a hinge on one side and the screw, a screw closure on, on the other. It's very similar to the full parves. As you can see here, it's just been freshly clean, polished, and is in immaculate condition. Just been refurbished. You can see here. So it's very similar in the closure settings as one side is a hinge, hinge here, and a hinge here, and then the closure and the, the, the clasp setting there. So this bracelet has a slightly different closure system uh, compared to any of the others, the SMs. What, what you do is, when unscrewing this, or when opening the closure I should say, you don't unscrew this. You don't want to turn this fully and keep going anti-clockwise. This has about, so what you want to do is, the line of the screw head is horizontal in this horizontal position. So it, at the moment it's in the locked position and matches all of the the other motifs as the the opening of the screw head is in the same position so now to open this and and in this position you can't open it this is in the locked position it doesn't open um, easily so then what you do is you just line your your screwdriver up and you turn it just a quarter of a turn so you then make the opening, the head of the screw, in a horizontal fashion, if you're looking at it in this um, way. So now, the screw head is facing upwards in comparison to the other screw motifs. That is now in the open position, and all you have to do is pull, and it comes apart. Very easily. If we have a closer look, just in the, the mechanism, What you'll see is there's like a sort of a cup which is in a C shape. So that C shape is now in the open position like this. Then what happens when you turn the screw, it turns like this and then it locks into place. With the other tongue has a small, let's see the focus is. It has a small clip, which the 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 other side then locks into place when you turn the screw head. So you have to make sure that before you try to pull or open it, that you have one the screw head in the right position to be uh, put back in. So it has to be in the open position, and then when you're tightening it, you then do the same. You turn it back a quarter of a turn. And it's now in the locked position. And this is the safety mechanism, the safety clasp for it. And again, you don't need a screwdriver for this. Just is it's very easy to open. You don't need to use much force. Even just just a piece, of, just with your nail, you can very easily turn the the clasp or the the screw very easily. Oh, the other way. There we go. And it's done, it's open. So once open, now it becomes very easy, no hassle. You're never in a, in a position where you can't lock it or unlock it. And so you go back the other way and it's now locked.
and that's now in the safety position, the safe position to, to be worn. And that concludes our video. If you'd like to see more videos like this, please like, share, subscribe and click on the notification buttons. And any suggestions you have, please leave a comment below. Hope you've enjoyed and see you next time.